So I will start, uh, thank you for your question. Uh, I will start by saying that uh, we had a script written entirely by Radu and uh, my wish was to respect what he wrote there because I find it was and it is a brilliant script. I felt extremely uh, represented by what he wrote but uh, Radu always says that when he makes a casting, uh, he chooses uh, the actors uh, not to make them become something different than they already are. So I knew Radu for a while now, we collaborated in different projects since uh, 2016 at uh, uh, his movie uh, that he did back then, uh, Barbarians, uh, and uh, he knew me, he knew me on stage also because he went and, and he sees a lot of theater also, and I, I, I didn't work actually so much at the theater, and Radu says that even if it's a fiction you know, movie, even if it's, it's fiction, uh, each fiction has its own dose of documentary because actually the actors uh, share their personality, their voice, their appearance, their energy, everything to the character and to the movie. So it's a mixture of this and I think that this is so great about this movie that it's somehow a part of me, a part of my creation that I did on social media but also a lot of of uh, Radu's uh, mind and knowledge and uh, brilliant uh, personality that are combined in this. So actually working at the character wasn't uh, an issue. We didn't work so much, but we talked a lot and he gave me a lot of references to watch, to see movies. This was the process. that uh, veridicity that a non-professional actor has and I think that was a very important aspect and I think it's important that the movie offered somehow a platform for them to, to, to be part of it. I think it's a, a very great for the movie. And I, want, I felt empowered while doing that and I also uh, wanted to show while criticizing this with my uh, avatar Bobica, I wanted to show that it's actually a form of domination that we have to oppose to, fight against and, uh, and make it somehow stop. And I, I, it was uh, somehow empowering for me because while putting this uh, filter that uh, I found on Snapchat, uh, it was ridiculous and funny in a way, and it was a very thin line that I, I found very uh, interesting to, to experiment and to to try to diffuse uh, this critic on my social media platforms. As if they were actors and it was the same, uh, almost the same process. Uh, they all uh, went to a casting. I was at the casting with them. Um, and uh, I will talk about uh, Ovidu Bershan, who has one of the uh, leading roles in the, in the movie. Uh, we rehearsed uh, as if he was a professional actor. He was very uh, willing to participate in this project. He was very uh, focused. Uh, in learning and absorbing as much as he could and uh, 
it was the same process as if he and they would have been professional actors. Say what what it tells me. I think everybody uh, will find something different to take from this movie. Uh, for me, I think it's an extraordinary collage um, of different representation uh, representations of Romania from back then until today. And I think uh, it's interesting to see how the society changed. I think it's uh, interesting to see how uh, the perception uh, of uh, women changed in our society and I, I don't know if it's in a good or in a bad way but it definitely changed um, and uh, I think um, it's somehow a document which tells a story about small times that passed before and are, are ongoing today. And I think this is interesting to watch and to observe and to, and to reflect about how the society changes in not so uh, many historical years. Actually, that uh, veridicity that a non-professional actor has, and I think that was a very important aspect. And I think it's important that the movie offered somehow a platform for them to 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 be part of it. I think it's a very great for the movie, as if. They were actors, and it was the same, uh, almost the same process. Uh, they all uh, went to a casting. I was at the casting with them, um, and uh, I will talk about uh, Ovidiu Bershan, who has one of the uh, leading roles in the in the movie. Uh, we rehearsed. Uh, as if he was a professional actor, he was very uh, willing to participate in this project. He was very uh, focused uh, in learning and absorbing as much as he could. And uh, it was the same process as if he and they would have been professional actors. Difficult um, uh, working relationship in theater. It was, we were so familiar and we have such a close relationship that I was unable to uh, keep it uh, in, a, in a working ethic and we did two theater shows together and they were uh, very emo both we were very emotional and we brought the conflict at, conflict at home and it was uh, um, we decided not to work together because we are absolutely too close and we cannot be professionals but uh, when the invitation uh, uh, came uh, from Radu, uh, both of us were uh, con conscious that it was actually a, a, a nice, uh, an important touch to the, to the movie and it, it was, uh, it worked out amazing, it was, uh, there were two days of shooting I think uh, or just one, I don't remember exactly, but, but it went smoothly. I, I'm extremely proud that my mother uh, is in this movie. It means a lot to me and for her as well. And uh, maybe uh, having this experience so smooth and uh, good, uh, maybe we will be able to work together, together soon.
Can I say, uh, I, I was uh, anxious uh, before meeting her because she's such an icon of the contemporary cinema and I, uh, I was uh, overwhelmed um, by knowing her but actually getting to know her I discovered a, a, a funny, a brilliant, kind uh, person that I absolutely admire and uh, I am so thankful to uh, know and be able to share some hours with her and I, I what can I say, it was one of the best uh, experiences of my life and I am totally grateful and I respect her and love her and she is amazing.